How's it? Indian Cowboy Doc Sports.com going to draw Wednesday, September the 13th. Have your free pick winner in just a second here. A lot of games to talk to you about. Nice free pick winner yesterday as we gave you the Twins. And they ended up winning. In fact, back-to-back-to-back -to -back -to -back free pick winners. Three in a row. And uh, we try to make it four in a row today. Not to mention a 7-2 and two and a 14-4 and four and 16-7 and seven free pick run. That's pretty good. Nice YouTube premium winner yesterday as well. And uh, hopefully we'll get you a nice... Um, what was our YouTube premium winner on? I think it was on... Uh, was it the under? I think it was the under on a ball game. Let me see here. Yeah, it was the under in um, Miami-Milwaukee, under 7.5. So, great thought there as well. But hello, I'm Indian Cowboys. This is Doc Sports. Indian Cowboys has been around for 19 years. Doc Sports has been around for 53 years. Been around a long time. How this works, our best selections over at DocSports.com. Under Arun Shiva, our next best selections are our YouTube Premium Thoughts, where we give you three extra, or four extra selections these days, every single day, all for just... Um, $20 a month, and it is probably one of the best deals on the internet where you get four extra thoughts every single day, about 200 thoughts per month, all for just $20 a month. Um, so, you know, it's a, our teaching channel where we teach you how to fish and how to look at ball games in depth. But our best selections, again, are over at DocSports.com under Rudin Shiva. I have a doctorate and a master's in biostatistics, and that's how these algorithms work. And of course, I've been around 19 years, and Doc Sports has been around 53 years. Our final best selections are our free picks and leans, which you're watching right now. The link to YouTube Premium, how to get there, is in the comment section, as well as how to get your free $60 worth of premium selections. If you want even more content, hop onto our Twitter. It has our consensus reports, our trends on late night ball games, our hot takes on sports, and our latest updates. We have two four-unit baseball selections today. Super excited about it. We took a pass yesterday, but obviously we gave you a free pick winner, and uh, we did really well on YouTube Premium. We actually went 3-0 and on YouTube Premium yesterday, which is a pretty big deal. Um, and we pushed on the other selection. So not only did we give you the Royals, which was an underdog winner, we gave you Miami-Milwaukee under, and then we gave you the Royals underdog winner, then we gave you the A's plus the 2.5, and, and they ended up not even needing the 2.5 runs. They ended up winning 6-2. And uh, we pushed on the Angels Seattle. So YouTube Premium can't get much better than that. And we'll have a ton of football content for you after I research the card tonight. And we'll have about 10 thoughts on the YouTube Premium and the daily video tomorrow as well. So imagine how much content that is. Your free play today. And uh, so be sure to sign up for the football week. Sign up for the WNBA, which is the start of the playoffs for you to selection. You know, baseball, MMA, soccer, NBA, college basketball, and hockey around the corner. Lots of great things. Your free pick winner today is I like the Miami Marlins today to make an upset, sort of, uh, against here the Milwaukee Brewers. They lost 0-12 to and 1-3 to in the last two games, so they've scored one run in the last two games, and they're going to bounce back, obviously, today. I don't think they lose three in a row, and I think Milwaukee's off of four. They're off four to five, four or five wins, which is pretty good, but Miami should be good here. One run the last two games, decent public fade. Garrett and McGill here. Garrett has a 3.82 ERA, coming off the shortest outing of the year. Three innings, three hits, one run against the Dodgers. And uh, he went 5-4-0 against Houston. Five innings, four hits, no runs. That's a pretty big deal. McGill is primarily a relief pitcher getting a crack here. I like, you know, I don't think he has his feet wet as far as starts and innings pitched. And I like Miami on the bounce back. Just two runs in their previous two games. Garrett coming off a shaky start as well. And McGill not having his feet wet as far as innings pitched. Makes sense. Give me the Marlins today. Cincinnati and Detroit, the Reds and the Tigers. That's U2 premium today. Uh, Padres Dodgers I like the over here San Diego lost 2-11 to that last game and I think they're an active dog I think they're going to be a surprising active dog I think Pepio is a young pitcher he's gone 12 innings 3 hits no runs but I think against Arizona Miami but I think he gets hit today I think San Diego's on the bounce back I think San Diego does well not to mention the fact that you have Snell here who beat the Dodgers in his last effort actually uh, 5 innings 8 hits 3 runs and the Dodgers have also revenge as well not to mention the fact that he's given up 12 walks in his last three games. I think both these uh, teams hit him pretty well. And I like the over, which is a decent public fade. Texas-Toronto, that's YouTube premium. Arizona and the Mets, give me the Mets plus the one or even the one and a half. They lost four to seven yesterday, so not a bad choice here. Mets won 7-4 yesterday, so obviously you could take Arizona on the bounce back. But you have Gallon and Lucchesi here. Gallon 3.31 ERA. He went nine innings, three hits, and no runs against the Cubs. And I love fading him coming off a complete game. He went 5-8-5 and five against the Orioles, 5-9-6 and six against the Dodgers. He had gone 6-7-1 and one against, the te against Texas. Um, but I think at the end of the day, you get Lucchesi here who went five innings, four hits, and no runs against, er against the Cardinals. And he's actually a decent pitcher. And I think uh, you're going to have... Uh, uh, you're going to have Gallon on a letdown after the complete game. And I like the Mets, plus the one or even one and a half. Red Sox-Yankees, that's U2 Premium. So we got, we got four U2 Premium thoughts today. today. One, two, three. Yeah. How many games did I do today? Three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Yeah. So three on YouTube Premium. Got it. So your final thought here, Minnesota-Connecticut, I like Minnesota uh, in the WNBA. Okay. 
Best of three begins here. Minnesota at, as, uh, facing Connecticut, nine-point dogs. Connecticut beat this team by 10-4, 21-5. So they beat them four times this year. Minnesota's off of a loss to Indiana, back-to-back -back losses. I don't like Connecticut coming off a loss to Chicago in overtime, frankly. However, I got to take Minnesota here. They swept Dallas at one point. They got blown out by New York. But at the end of the day, this team comes off back-to-back -back losses. They have triple revenge against Connecticut. And they only scored nine points in the fourth quarter in their last game. So that's going to leave a bitter taste in their mouth coming into this game as well. That's what I have for you guys. YouTube Premium, I will see you in five minutes. Hope you enjoyed the content today. Please take a moment to like and subscribe. Indian Cowboy working hard for you every single day.